Look at me. Look at me. Do I look like I'm playing here? You know what? I don't need this. I know you don't need this. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to let you walk. Go on. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, wait. Just one last thing before you go. Oleg. Six feet four, Russian boss of the local bratva. Well, it turns out, last week, a couple of his operatives were robbed at gunpoint. They were on their way to conduct some business, carrying upwards of 1.5 million under the engine of their Audi R8. Nice car, by the way. Me, I prefer something a little less flashy. Say, the 640 horsepower 911 Turbo S with a 3.8 liter six cylinder engine. You know, something a little more subtle. But that's me. Anyway, cut a long story short. Oleg's men were found dead, shot execution style and dumped in a ravine in Nickel Canyon. Oleg is very piqued about what happened to his men and more so his money. You might ask, why does someone who is the top member of an organization that takes in $250 billion annually care about a measly 1.5 mil? A lot of Oleg. Whether it's a million dollars or 25 cents, it's all about principle. And it goes something like this. If you steal from the Bratva, you, your family, your friends, and your pets will all be cut up into little pieces and buried in the desert. So what's this got to do with me? You like Palm Springs, Seamus? You're fucking with me. Am I? Yeah. You can't threaten me over something I have nothing to do with. Can't I? Is this being recorded? Yo, are we being recorded? Yes. There's a camera up there and there. The room is mic'd, and there's an officer in an adjacent room watching us on a monitor as he records everything we say. Then that's entrapment or some shit. You can't threaten me over something I have nothing to do with. Threaten my family and shit? Nah. I ain't gotta talk to you. This is a joke. This isn't a joke, Seamus. This is an interrogation in which I'm asking you questions about a narcotics deal gone wrong in which six people ended up dead, and a 12-year-old boy and his six-year-old sister have been abducted and are nowhere to be found. This is bullshit. I want a lawyer. What we know is that you and your cousin Marcus were there when everything went down. What we know is that you had arranged for the drop-off and secured the location, and that your cousin Marcus had rented a Ford Fiesta from a nearby enterprise. What we know is that in the trunk of that Ford Fiesta, we found a gun, which we have traced to at least two of the six bullets that killed two of the six dead. So if you think I give a rat's ass for a single moment about breaking the law and throwing my career down the toilet, let me reassure you, I will do whatever it takes to get those two kids home safely, even if it means personally handing you over to Oleg myself. You can't do that. Oh, but can't I? 